I know it's been a long time. You haven't heard this voice in ages and seen this face, but see, I was stuck in the days of darkness and couldn't pull myself back up out of it. So today, I want to talk about what it's like to be this man. This man. With withered memories incomplete. Oftentimes, it has me scattered and confused as my life's passions and dreams frequently change, as does my process of rational thought and all the life choices that depends on me. Where does the strength come from that keeps me going anymore? I'm not really sure. I've heard of being carried to the sands by God, and when you only see one pair of footprints after looking down, this is when you are supposed to let go of the masculine ego and pride. You're not in charge anymore at this time. There are bigger and more divine hands relieving the weight and pressures of this life, so don't fight it. See, that's where I'm at right now. I might not meet the criteria of what a man is in your eyes, but you have no idea of the internal fortitude it has taken to go this far with you. See, you may never understand through my eyes or my mind, and maybe you might not even care to take the time. As hurtful as that is, I get it, it's fine. But maybe, just maybe, I can explain what it's like to be a man. This man with a heart as big as life, now drained of his spirit. His fight, his drive, is but brought down to be dragged to the murky waters of misery, guilt, and depression, no sunshine, just gray, stormy, clouded skies. How much of a statue of a man in your eyes would I be to you if you knew the tears that flooded these eyes many nights in the dark where it's easy to hide and I cry from carrying the amounts of mental spirits or pain inside. It's weight that I can no longer hide. It's got me exhausted, so fucking tired. So now that you have me weakened and verbally call me coward, how dare you after you've seen my transformation once I walk through the fire and baptize the past in the opposing waters, how dare you? I ask again, question me as a man. Thank you for waking up today. This Rebel Jones, peace.